on the face of it, the Indian commercial vehicle industry may look glamorous and exciting with its good-looking buses and large trucks. But you take a closer look into the lives of those behind the wheels of these mammoth machines, you realize their story is one of stress, risks of all kinds, mental and physical discomfort, and lack of respect. And to make matters worse, many of them are ill-trained too, and there are hardly any organized place to receive training. It is here that Maruti Suzuki, the largest car manufacturer in India and the makers of some very popular cars, has stepped in to do some good work. The company has since 1999 been relentlessly training people in the country to drive cars, buses and trucks in categories known as light motor vehicles or LMVs and heavy motor vehicles or HMVs. Incidentally, in the financial year 2018-19, the company trained around 400,000 people at the seven Institutes of Driving and Traffic Research IDTRs, and 16 Road Safety Knowledge Centers RSKCs. These have been set up in association with the state governments of Delhi, Haryana, Gujarat, Uttarakhand, Bihar and Maharashtra for these initiatives. In fiscal 2018-19, it has invested around rupees 1.54 billion towards corporate social responsibility or CSR activities that are focused towards community development, road safety and skill development. In this video, we shall be touching upon one of their initiatives that focus on road safety. As part of road safety, the company has set up several IDTRs where people are trained to drive anything from a simple car to a big bus or truck. Training is offered to existing as well as new drivers of private as well as commercial vehicles. Also specialized training is given to operate forklifts. Additionally, traffic violators and license seekers are also provided guidance, this along with the help of the respective state government. We visited the IDTR at Bahadurgarh in Haryana, which Maruti Suzuki has set up with the assistance of the Transport Department of Haryana. Haryana has two IDTRs, one here at Bahadurgarh and the other at Rohtak, both of which have been operational since 2011. If you want to bus or truck, you can take training in this institute. The course fee is a mere Rs. 7,500 plus GST for an HMV learner and only rupees 3500 for an LMV learner. The former is a 30 day course while the latter is of 21 days. Ji ha, agar aapko heavy motor vehicle chalana hai, jaise bus ya truck, tab aapko 7500 rupee lagenge plus GST. Aur ye course 30 din ka hai. Agar light motor vehicle chalana hai, tab sirf 3500 rupee lagenge aur ye 21 Dinoka course hai. We were shocked to know that there is a huge interest among youth in Haryana to learn HMVs because both at Rotak as well as Bahadurgarh, the waiting period for admission to a learner course is several months. Motown India learned that a handful of senior Maruti Suzuki full-time employees are overseeing these IDTRs and they are paid directly by Maruti Suzuki and they are permanent employees of the car company. They act as the supervisors and are answerable to the top management of the company as well as senior officials of the state government. Today, after years of persistent hard work, the efforts of the various state governments and of course the commitment of Maruti Suzuki, the IDTRs are making a revenue of almost rupees 140 million per annum and there is quite a surplus fund running into several millions of rupees with them. The money is continuously used for upgrading technology and equipment besides salary for the staff and maintenance. The Haryana IDTR network today consists of two IDTRs and around 18 road safety knowledge centers spread across several places in Haryana. All these are run with the help of Haryana transport department officials and the expenses are met by the revenues generated by the IDTRs. In the year 2018, 3,159 people had undergone a training at the two IDTRs in Haryana for HMV license. Bahadurgarh had 1,564 applicants. If one takes into account all the training for learners, refresher courses and stall evaluation, then there were 63,705 applicants. 
If one were to include road safety trainings at RSKCs, then the number goes up to 2,43,810. Chalo, ab license par aate hai. Wo bhi HMV license. Yaad rakhna, everything is cashless here. Course fees aapko credit card ya debit card ya Paytm ke through dena hai. अगर आपके पास ये कुछ भी नहीं है फिर आप आई बैंक के थ्रू भी पैसे जमा कर सकते हैं काउंटर पर आपका फोटो लिया जाएगा आपको अपना आधार कार्ड या कोई भी सरकारी पहचान पत्र एज अ प्रूफ दिखाना होगा कोर्स कंसिस्ट ऑफ सेवरल प्रोसेस विच आर इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड द टेक्निक ऑफ ट्रेनिंग इज वॉट इज मोर इंटरेस्टिंग द इंस्टीट्यूट इनिशियली गिव ट्रेनिंग ऑन अमुलेटर फॉर एन एस्पिर to learn and test his skills ye kafi interesting hai aisa lagta hai ki aap ek video game khel rahe ho theory classes yoga classes follow then finally one has to give a practical test on the track the track test is done in the presence of a trainer who watches you and more interestingly cameras in the sky to watch you and idtr is called aritra a word meaning navigation or one who shows the right path it is basically a camera based image processing technology for quality driving training and was developed by idtr in 2016 with investment from maruti suzuki here around 27 cameras are installed across the identified path and using go mapping and image sensing technology a live tracking of the vehicle is done via wifi even a mobile app is created that supports an instant input and feedback the data collected by the system automatically shows the progress made by the trainee for hmv license aspirants the idtr is a vast and technically competent system of training and evaluating a training that consists of theory and practical tests yoga inculcating financial literacy automated tests can only bring out the best truck and bus drivers in the country it's not about being a lady or a man it's about being a capable truck or bus driver that would mean good driving safe driving and all this will contribute so much to road safety and that is what maruti suzuki is striving for road safety in a country that has one of the world's highest number of road accidents for the company it's not just about making cars it's also about contributing to a safer world